Hello. Hi. I am Patricia McNeely. I am an illumined Blu-ray twin flame from Chicago, Illinois. I hope you're doing well today. Today I'm presenting to you uh, my next webinar, and yeah, it's a webinar, and uh, there's several things I want to talk to you about today. So as you may know, a lot of these energies have been gearing up for people to be together and carrying us into 2017. 2017 is going to look a lot different than 2016 did. And there's going to be uh, just a finality to certain things. There are going to be things that people are realizing that they're at the end of. However, nobody is left hanging. And my webinar is called Abundance. It doesn't hurt you to listen to this, to what I have to say, because even what I have to say, you can glean things from. So please listen till the end. And I'm calling this one Abundance from 5D to Here. So I, I talk about several things. This is a live webinar. I'm doing it three separate times so that you have an opportunity to ask individual questions. Now, a couple of things that I would like to uh, let people know is that there's a lot of misconceptions out there that I'd like to clear up, and I clear up a lot of things in the webinar as well. Everyone here has value. You have value locally, and you have value globally, cosmically, and universally. Every life matters, and we're seeing a lot of this. Every life matters. Participation is important, and people are feeling the callings of their heart. Some people are getting very upset, and they're feeling sort of like their hands are tied. I can't do anything. I'm feeling to do something. I don't know what to do. And it's, it's taking a little bit for this to congeal for you and formulate itself. I want to take a lot of that guesswork out for you in addition to being in a safe, closed, protected environment with guidance, with 5D coming through. And so this is going to, uh, see, that these are some of the, let's say, broader based things that I'm going to talk about. It's going to be about the fresh starts, which I've been saying for quite some time. And yet, this is it for a lot of people. For people who need to reinvent themselves or feel that you're somehow reworking, things aren't going right for you, you might have had the golden touch and then everything you touch turns to dust and you don't know why. Take this webinar. It's going to help you because you're going to get a lot out of it. Um, this is your fresh start and this is your flow in everything. And there's reasons for this. The reason is you're done with Earth. For the most part, we are done with karma. We're done with 3D Earth. And you're going to feel it. It's not that you're doing anything wrong. It's more like how it's going to feel for you. How's that working for you? You could ask yourself, that's not really working for me. Or I used to do this. I've done this all the time. And it's not working anymore. Or, I used to be able to make a deal happen. I used to get this, I get that, and the universe seems to be taking things away from me. It's not that the universe is taking things away. The door is being closed on old timelines. And so you are collapsing all old things. And through this, I'm going to teach you the value of staying still and just being to create. So some people know this, uh, mostly Blu-ray, Rod and Staff, union people. Couples that are together, um, they will sometimes be struggling through things. And sometimes you're at a disparity with each other. And there are a lot of couples where there's a disparity in your economic position. One seems to have a lot and the other one doesn't seem to. And you might struggle to create. You might struggle to keep body and soul together, as they say it. You might feel like you're not maintaining, you're living hand to mouth. And nobody intends for you to live this way. This will become effortless creating together with your twin 
no forcing or pushing. So I talk about that. These are your new beginnings in union, and it's important. Why? Because you're more than just earthbound now. You may not like it. You may want to retreat it back into things that you know. You're essentially going to be going like this. Do do do. I think I know this, but your spirit is just going to keep pulling you out of it. And when you're out, sometimes you might say, I don't know what to do. I can feel it. Some of how it feels is the job feels like a dead end. You try to find a job and you can't find a job. You find a job that's undervaluing you and not paying you what you're really worth. You've got a um, degree and you need to go out and do something and yet it feels like there's just doors being closed in your face. You may not have any experience and that is that is an issue. That's an issue all over where you know people have something or they've spent a lot of money educating themselves only to come and find out that it's not working for them. And we certainly don't wish this upon anyone. What we would like to do through this is to help you find your flow. And not only that, find a rhythm that is suitable for your union. Your union isn't going to fit itself conveniently into old structures. That's why you're collapsing that. But yet, it can be very scary, alarming. It can be frightening. It can make you panic. And that's happening with a lot of people. They get anxious. They panic. Um, and I'm going to say something else right now. The Blu-ray Rod and Staff Unions, Rod and Staff Blu-rays are opening this for all Twin Flames. We open it up for other Twin Flame unions. We get where we're going so things can open. Our love fires the new grid. And so things are getting into place. So all of these retrograde energies, but especially the Venus, Mars, Saturn, and Jupiter energies, have been putting the structure or making the proper connections available for people. And that is what you will find through this is that you get a reconnection, you get an attunement for you and your union. Maybe you're not struggling, but your twin is. And you look at them and you say, they really need to be doing something. My goodness, if my family knows I'm still paying attention to that person, they, they're just going to hate him or her. They're going to judge us. They will not be able to accept them. They, that person doesn't make enough money. They can't support me properly. Or I need to support. Or I have children to support. People have karmic children. And the prospect of breaking away even if it's been, it's that prison that maybe is very familiar. You know how to deal with the abuser. You know how to deal with everything, except it is feeling very suffocating and the walls are closing in. And you need your abundance back. You need to be free. You really need to be a sovereign being. That is who you truly are. What are some of the ties that bind? It's this. It's this. It's this. This is the number one reason why people will not make a move, even though they know in their hearts that they should. And yet, it is the direction that you're intended to go. We are no longer having lives where starving or limitations for the sake of love are your choices. That's duality. We are leaving duality. You can have love or you can have security. That's BS. And for people that say, well, I really don't need my twin. Yes, you physically will be with your twin. And you're not intended to drain each other. You're intended to energize each other. You're intended to have a free flow of love, romance, fun, adventure, travel, all of that, that that entails. And you will be getting this. 
you may be at one of these standstills. You may feel like your soul just has you stay put for a minute. So if you need a jump start, if you really are at that crossroads, try my webinar. And I want to show you something. Not just the money part. Not just, you know, whatever people need to survive. Because this is a modicum of exchange. This is fallen into a bad rep. This is, this, this has had a lot of connotations to it. It's security, it's control, and it's, it's having a proper relationship with it. Whatever form it takes. So I'm going to show you something here. This is, I made a little list of just people I've spoken to you. So I've showed you, I've showed you my glo um, my world map to show you where people are sort of placed. Key positions. There's a lot of twin flames around metro areas on the coasts. I want to talk to you about professions and what do people do. This is one of the misconceptions I want to clear up right now. This comes through a lot through people's sessions. Or when they talk to me, they say, am I supposed to drop everything I'm doing and, you know, become a healer or become this or become that? And I will say to you, no, no, no. The reason is, is the light and the love exists everywhere, even in places that you may not think so, okay? And if you are declaring a certain area of the globe, and I don't mean a geographic area, I mean some part like healthcare, education, government, military. If you declare it to be dark, that's what you're going to get. However, I prepared this so that you can see that I have spoken to people in pretty much all walks of life who have met their twin, who have amazing love stories. Every single one of these represents one or several people I've spoken to who has an amazing, adventurous, romantic love story. So pilot, several pilots and or drivers. I've spoken to people who drive, doctors, lawyers, counselors, social worker, bankers, Yes, the light and the love exists in banking. Politician, little few and far between, but they're there. And yes, there are ones who care and lead with their heart. Teachers, travel agents, scientists, and these are researchers. These are people who research pharmaceuticals for medicines. Uh, mathematicians, statisticians. Statistics people, um, people that uh, work in some kind of insurance related to mathematics, computer technicians, artists and painters, so yes, the fine arts, musicians, singers, songwriters, producers, directors, screenwriters, a lot of people writing their story for a screenplay. And let me tell you, when I do their session, I get the timelines on when that's going to come to fruition. It may not be next month, but it is coming. Screenwriter. Some people are wearing a couple of hats. They do this and they're writing their story. Filmmakers. Got to have someone to make actually make the twin flamey films. Actors and actresses. And you're going to have to have real lovers playing the actual Love parts. Yes, you will. Watch and see. Lots of shakeups going to happen so that true love is in place. Author, writer, commercial artist. This is designers and architects also. And a lot of this is what I refer to as the red ray. A lot of this is both purple and platinum. So what are you bringing to the table? Salespeople. 
Animal healers, such as an animal whisperer. I have several people I've spoken to who work with horses and heal horses. They do Reiki on the horses. Um, they do herbals for the horses. They do therapy or they do therapy for disabled humans. And it's good therapy. And guess what their union is doing? Healing. So they're from the green, Ray, models, real estate agents, construction workers, architecture, set designers, clothes designers, makeup artists. I was very privileged to meet someone who does makeup for entire wedding parties and not just makeup on the face. Beautiful, I think it's called Mendy Henna makeup for the entire party. So what kind of magic gets brought to someone's wedding when a twin flame is working on them? You see where I'm going with this, okay? Um, journalist, holistic and spiritual healing arts. This is where a lot of people feel called. However, however, I have something to say about this because from 5D to here, who is going to get healing for people who are fifth dimensional beings? Come on and tell me, okay? Because there will be people, there will be babies born, there will be people who are midwives, all kinds of stuff. Expand yourself. Expand your awareness of this. I want you through this to not limit yourself, but to really focus you know, what you're feeling called in your heart to stop the frustrations, to stop hitting your head on the economic glass ceiling for yourself. Reiki herbalist, acupuncture, tarot reader, healthcare professionals like nurses, phlebotomists, people that take blood, um, x-ray technicians, ultrasound technicians, people that help deliver babies, midwives, whether you're working in a traditional hospital or you work outside the hospital and you deliver in people's homes. And sometimes that's the only way it used to be. Life coaches, sports coaches, professional athletes, personal trainers, government officials. Yes, yes, the light and the love is in the government. So please don't negate people that they're out there. They're there. They're holding things. They've been the light and the love in some really dense places. And yeah, sometimes they have some intense struggles because they would like to get out and yet sometimes they know. I'm the only person, you know, brave enough to show my heart here. And I think I said this already, astrologer, photographer, mechanics, and the list goes on. You can see I filled an entire sheet here um, with professions and it's going to be more because as more innovations come out as people come out with technology like you could look at you know what have certain sectors um, been able to put people to work you know look at the invention of television or radio and how many people that's been put to work you could take you could take this list and say well, with television, we needed lawyers to drop contracts. We needed um, a teacher to teach someone the behind the scenes stuff. We needed a set designer. We needed a producer. We needed a director. We need someone to write the script. We needed actors and actresses and artists. And right there, you've got 10 people that have been put to work with one invention. And even that invention was a collaborative effort. So. A lot of people like to keep things separate. You like to have your spiritual world, which actually was how it was at one point. And this has even created resentments about people because they get angry about, you know, whose God it is, or that's my God, or that's your God, and my God does this, and your God does that. And we're getting rid of all this bad blood. We are having many more international, global interactions. And when you take the things that we've separated ourselves from 
And for me, it's always about bringing spirit right into the heart of things. You're bringing it in to anything that you do, into any endeavor, your business, your home, all of your interactions. If you go to a business, if you go somewhere to buy something or you go to a service, you want that to be as light and loving as possible. You want to walk away going, woohoo, that was a great interaction. That was money well spent. That was something that I really, I, I think I got good value. And value can be placed in several ways. But what you'll find is that your heart's going to feel what, you know, where do you want to go? So I talk about a lot of things here in my webinar. I want you to know that there are Rod and Staff Blu-ray um, teachers and healers. And the primary thing we are doing is opening for all twin flames. That is not all beings that live here upon this earth. And yet other people will be the, they will benefit from it. They will be the benefactors of it. And we have the ability to bring source love through. Why? Because we're from there. And this is not to exclude anyone. Everyone is important. I speak the way I do because Blu-ray people have very important agreements that sometimes are very painful to um, get themselves through. It's been painful to purge things. It's been painful to have to make life changes. And yet we do it because there is a direction we're going with this. And yes, there are people coming together every single day. So if you or your twin are struggling to know, well, what am I going to do for a living? I mean, really what a lot of people want to know is, what about the money, Patricia? What about the money? And do we even need money? Yes, you're going to need money. Yes, light, money makes life comfortable. Money isn't here to control you or be controlled. Money is, a, is intended to be a free-flowing exchange between people. And this is the modicum of what we use because we're able to, you know, establish. Well, if I go to the UK, this means so many euros. Or if I go to Mexico, this means so many pesos. And if I go to the United States, it means so many dollars. And, and I understand this money here has been in disuse for a while. This may be an antique at some point. Maybe it'll be worth some money. Just kidding. So bringing things from 5D to here so that it can be anchored properly, that's a lot of what you've been doing. But you still have to go forward and, yes, help your kids, teach your kids, get your kids the medical care or health care that they need, the fun. Who wants to be entertained? Who wants to entertain or travel? That's what that's what a lot of this is all about. So this is not only the brand new fresh start now that all of the platforms are in place. I'm going to go one step further here because a lot of people attend classes and the class won't really tell them um, like it will teach you something on what to do, but they don't always teach you some of the other nuts and bolts details that you need to know. And I have both been in business, uh, my parents had their own business, and I learned a lot, and I know about these things. I know about um, how, how would you set up things, and let me tell you, there's a lot of things that make it so much easier that take a lot of the fear out of it and just make it seamless for you to be on the fly. How nice would it be for you to receive money on the fly? How nice would it be for you not to be tethered to something? How nice would it be for you to take a day off when you really need to or if your child is ill or if you need to travel or you want to expand their consciousness and you just say we're going to a museum we're going for some fun we need a beach day we're gone fishing there's a lot of people that are very shaky that if they ask their boss you know there's going to be hell to pay somewhere down the line or you ask your spouse or you say oh hey I want to do this and I want to go somewhere and 
Oh boy, there's going to be hell to pay over that. Nobody should live like that. Nobody should live like that. And unfortunately, a lot of people have been living like this. So abundance is, is while I'm speaking about money and proper value, I'm also speaking about more than that because abundance is also your health, your well-being, your emotional well-being, not walking on eggshells, not feeling like you're living in a prison and you can't breathe, even if it might seem like a prison to get out of. And everything is in place for you to jump forward. I want to leave you with one more, one more thing here, okay? About, I don't know, it was maybe 10 months or a year ago, I started telling people who were feeling called, get ready, set yourself up because the people are going to awaken and they're going to need you. They're going to need you. People will need every single position here of you that operates from the heart, that does what's best for the situation, that draws in your solutions from a higher place. And how do you do that? So some people did. Some people positioned themselves and said, okay, I'm here, I'm hanging out my shingle. Some of you are getting ready because you're feeling it to hang out your shingle and say, I'm here, I'm here, this is what I do, and that's a good thing, and I'll tell you why. This world has about 7 or 8 billion people on it, and more people are going to awaken. That's what the Rod and Staff... Rod and Staff opening for all twins. So some of the people around you you thought have been asleep and they're going to have like a this boom bang kind of thing and they may need acupuncture. They may need to take their horse to get healed. They may need a lawyer. They may need you. So get ready. Why not get ready? Why not get a really good handle on it? Because I'm not just talking about taking an earth class or just motivating you. I'm talking about connections. I'm talking about the connection to the new grid of life, which is up here. It's not down here. It's up here. I've depicted this several times in my videos. I've also uh, talked about planetary energies, which come around again. I mean, in some ways, these energies are like the bus. You miss one bus, you're going to get another bus, but you're still going to get on the bus and go to where you're going. Some of you need to go. You need to go now. You need to go now. Now. Now, darn it. Not, you know, next year. And this is what I want to help you with. So, I'm having this um, three times next weekend on October 14th in the evening. It's evening here in Chicago. It will be Saturday morning in Australia. It will be uh, middle of the night in the UK. It will be a little later evening on the East Coast and a little earlier in the West Coast in Canada, Mexico, South America. And while I only speak a little bit of Spanish, this will be in English. So it's open to everyone. It's open whether or not you've met your twin. It's mostly geared for people that they want to get their flow going. They're feeling that they need to either get out of a job, find a job, find what they're called to do, and really have a good platform and confidence. I'm here to empower you and get going with this. It's October 15th at 4 p.m. with uh, 4 p.m. UK time. So I put UK time. Saturday, 4 in the afternoon, everyone in the UK, you can join that one. It's at a sensible time. It is going to be uh, morning here in the United States. And I think it will be middle of the night in Australia and India. And Sunday the 16th, again, this will be a morning time, 9 a.m. Central. If you miss the UK time on Saturday, you can grab it on Sunday. Um, you can grab it in the United States, Mexico, Canada, and South America. It's going to be pretty much a straight line of times, either give and take an hour or two hours. Two hours on the West Coast, an hour on the East Coast. And I'll have different times. If you're in Hawaii, the Pacific, um, Australia, this is going to be 
more than likely in um, your evening or late middle of the night. So you grab the Saturday time. I will have more information on my website, which is www.twinflamesmerge.com. I'm also available individual. My expectation with this is to have my presentation and, and give the recording to everyone who participates. This is a live participation, which means that you will have an opportunity to ask questions. Other people will hear you. And I hope, again, that it is a lively participation. I want it to be more like a, you know, uh, something that's really lively and not just like a classroom. We all know that there's people that, you know, they don't like to go to class. I'm a person where I'm like, let's cut to the chase. Let's get it done. Let's find out the fastest way to do it. Let's do it and let's go on with our lives. That's what I want to empower people with. I'm not intending for everyone to trip around in this. So um, we'll spend a little time going over that. And hopefully what's in it will answer a lot of questions. But if questions come up, we're right there. I'm right there with guidance for you. So thanks so much for your time. Thanks for listening and hanging in here. I hope that you check it out. You'll get a lot out of it. Bye now.